Simply Cards and Paper Craft Magazine is here, and this is issue 214, wow. And this has um, not only the magazine, of course, but as we know, there's going to be something else. This time, it's called an herb garden. And you can peek in the windows and see an embossing folder. In fact, let me just pull this out, just so that you can really see everything that's inside, okay. So there are stamps, there are 40 stamps here. There's this mini embossing folder, that's really kind of fun. And then a little uh, plant uh, poke and a terracotta pot or whatever kind of pot you wanna make. In fact, I'm seeing right here, you can use that embossing folder on the pot to give it some texture. So lots of things going on just on the packaging. There are also eight digital papers that are included, and that will be a download that's in the magazine that will tell you how to get there. So let me get started and show you. So we're going to start with this, which is uh, stylish stamping. So it's using some of those stamps, and the download information is right here. And we'll go over and see some step-by-steps. This is giving you some ideas of how to create your backgrounds, but also using that tiny embossing folder as a background to that really pretty little piece. And then uh, with the stamps, you can create, this happens to be oregano, so they've taken the plant poke and put it on there and written oregano. Uh, don't stop beleafing, that's really cute. And then you've got a whole set of them on this card. Uh, you see an oval there. The oval is not included, by the way, but it does make a good look if you have that. So you can see uh, coffee and plants. Uh, let's birthday wishes. It was meant to be. Uh, uh, congratulations on your achievement there <laughs> with, with chives. And there you go. So just uh, some fun, uh, playful uh, pieces. Now this is a section on a double Z fold card and you can really see it right there. I know Teresa has done that type of card in many of our webisodes, but this way you get step by step and you get to see it with lots of different kinds of products. So that's kind of fun. Now this is um, using some uh, designs for inking and um, I, whether or not you have these particular papers or these particular dies, I thought it was really fun to see, do a circle in gold and then do some stamping along one corner, doing a tone on tone of um, pink on pink and then putting a white banner. Here's a little box. So I thought that was just a nice um, kind of ideas to share. Now this is using the um, stamps uh, in some different ways, as you can see. So taking some embroidery hoops and building them on it, adding some, they're calling them seed notelets. So it's using the identifier of the stamps, but also putting a little package of seeds with it. So I thought that was interesting. This is making a 3D watering can, very interesting. And so it, all the steps are there. This is making a little tray or a, covering a container. Actually, it's making it out of cardstock, my goodness. Okay, then um, this is a webisode that Debbie and Lene recently did with the Card Making Magic, the heart boxes. Thought I would show you that in case you missed it. Now these are called Fantastic Folds and wow, you can look how this is just really expands fun to see and if this is you what you like it certainly gives you the directions for it and here's just adding a tux, touch of texture like i said I, I noticed the burlap earlier i thought this was so so pretty and i hope you can see it if not there's just a splash of color underneath and then the stamping on top and then a little bit on top of it. eat drink and be rosemary <laughs> okay here we go with more, so again, more backgrounds doing kind of a very, very light mixed media. Again, must have gotten a bit of burlap because I see it on many places. And here we go, oh, this is pretty. Now that, you know, that embossing folder is not very large. It's probably just a couple of inches square. So this is a tiny card, but uh, packs a lot of punch right there, really sweet. And one more to share with you back here, oh, this is in another um, 
magazine that we have that we just arrived and you can you get all of these foil die cuts along with papers some foil papers and I wanted to point out that we have that too so Simply Cards and Paper Craft they always do a wonderful job this time you have a complete herb garden in the package and I am delighted to tell you that this is exclusively here at paperwishes.com